So we just uh, came to know about the examples of ecosystems. The ecosystems which are naturally made, like ponds, lakes, forests, these are the natural made ecosystems. While the ecosystem like like an like an uh, aquarium which is made by us, or an orchard, or uh, a garden, or a crop field, these are man-made systems. So they are known as man-made ecosystems. Now we know about the components, the biotic components of ecosystem in some more detail. As as we know that sun is the biggest and the sole energy source for earth. So when the light energy falls on earth, plants, then plants are the ones which convert this light energy to chemical energy. That's why plants are known as producers. So producers are one component of ecosystem and after these producers form various uh, food stuffs like glucose like which are, which are filled with glucose and various other food molecules these are consumed by consumers so the immediate animals to devour on green plants are known as consumers or primary consumers example we have small insects or we have small zoo planktons in water after this primary consumers and these consumers can be herbivores mostly primary consumers are herbivores and primary consumers which are then eaten by other animals are known as secondary consumers. We include bigger animals which can eat grasshoppers or flies like like a frog. And these are Omnivores, or parasites, so producers are the first link in the ecosystem which convert the light energy into chemical energy and all those organisms which eat producers or plants are known as consumers which can be classified as primary consumers and secondary consumers but primary consumers and secondary consumers together can be uh, either herbivores or omnivores or carnivores or parasites and when these consumers die they are again back, they are back to the soil as dead bodies and then they are decomposed by microorganisms. So the last level of this ecosystem is decomposers.